Today we're gonna to learn about the chin rest and its applications. The chin rest is a targeting behavior where your dog is going to target the bottom of their jaw to your hand and rest it there and keep it there. It has a lot of applications, but one of the biggest would be body handling and being able to safely handle your dog. You can also use the chin rest for things such as teaching a strong hold and retrieve behavior. So let's get started. When teaching the chin rest, you're going to sit in the chair with your dog in front of you. You're going to just start by reaching your hand underneath your dog's chin, clicking and rewarding. If you have a sensitive dog, it may take quite a while for them to be okay with you approaching with your hand. If you have a less sensitive dog, you can quickly move on to step two. In step two, you're going to reach out and just lightly touch your dog's chin, pushing the thumb up above the muzzle so that it's kind of wrapped in a C shape around your dog's chin. Click and reward. It's really important that the reaching of the hand precedes the click and the reward. So you're just gonna reach out, grab your dog's chin gently, and then click and reward that behavior. You're gonna continue to do this for quite a while with your dog until they're really comfortable with it. The next step is to reach your hand out under your dog's chin in anticipation of cradling it, and then you're just gonna hold it there. Ideally, what your dog is going to then do is push their chin down and into your hand because they're like, hey, this behavior that you want is chin in your hand. You're missing my chin. I should just rest my chin on your hand. You're going to click and heavily reinforce for that behavior because that's ultimately what we want. We wanna reach our hand out, our dog puts their chin in our hand and we reward that behavior. So that's what we're looking for. If you find that your dog doesn't automatically place their chin in your hand on that third step, go back and do more reinforcing of reaching your hand out and just touching their chin until they, until they understand the concept. Once you have a dog that is naturally putting their chin into your hand when you reach your hand out, you're gonna start adding a cue. When we add a cue, we do the new thing, then the old cue, and then click and reward. So what we're gonna do in this case would be, you're going to say chin, or whatever word you wanna use for this. So you'll say chin, you'll reach your hand out, the dog will put their, their neck or their, under, their jaw into your hand, and you're gonna click and reward. You're gonna continue that procedure with lots of reps until when you say chin, the dog is automatically reaching to put their chin in your hand. You can use this chin rest behavior to do different types of veterinary procedures, to look into your dog's ears, to look into their mouth and be able to have them stay still. You can also use it to teach a hold that doesn't have a gnawy grip on it. So it can help you teach a solid hold. So have fun with this game and teach your dog to rest their chin anywhere. Once they've been able to do it with you sitting in front of them, try doing it on your knee and see if you can have them target your chin to, their chin to your knee or while you're standing or while facing a different direction. So try it in lots of different locations in lots of different ways and you'll have a reliable chin behavior that'll help your dog rest and relax. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe and hit that little bell button so that you can be notified anytime a new video comes out. If you have questions, make sure you comment below or if you have ideas for videos or questions you'd like me to make into a video, make sure that you put those in the comments below. Share this with your friends. You guys have a great day and happy training. Ready, have a... Yeah, good girl. <laughs> Thanks for watching and stay tuned for our next video. Subscribe now and never miss an episode.